I want to present really quickly in the next 10 minutes is what I think are probably the top 10 reasons why we get architecture, enterprise architecture wrong. Um, I guess I've been lucky over the last few years, I've had opportunities to um, engage with architecture teams and organisations uh, across Canberra and other capital cities in Australia. Um, and that's ranged from long-term contracts that I've had in some government agencies here through to um, all sorts of different consulting assignments through to short-term engagements as a, a so-called industry analyst where I've had the chance to go and meet with um, architecture teams and practicing architects and talk to them about the challenges that they've got and hopefully give them some advice but also to listen to what their real issues are um, that they're facing. So that's been a really great opportunity for me to, I guess, meet lots and lots of people doing architecture and find out what are the common challenges and issues that people face. Um, so what I've done is I've put together a list of what I think are the top ten. Now this is not scientific, I haven't kept statistics, I haven't actually measured anything, it might not be a statistically relevant sample, I don't know, but um, there's some pretty strong trends that come out as you talk to people and I think, I suspect that lots of you will um, relate to what I'm about to talk about. Okay, here's my top ten. And I'm going to limit myself just to talking about the issues, which I know is a bit negative, but I don't want to try and get into solving them all tonight. Okay, there may or may not be a follow-up talk in a month or two um, to address that. First one is maturity mismatch. Uh, so this is where um, the enterprise architects in the organisation have a much more, typically a much more mature understanding of the way architecture should be done than what the organisation itself has. And because of that mismatch, it's hard to uh, engage and be effective with enterprise architecture. Number two, listen with your mouth closed. Um, I'm guilty of all of these issues myself, by the way. I'm not trying to stand up here and preach and say that I'm better. Uh, going into any engagement as a consultant or an architect, and a lot of the time as enterprise architects, we're a type of consultant. Uh, you want to add value, you want to say something, you want to give them some advice.